today's lesson is about friction. Friction. It is a force that is present between surfaces that are in contact with each other. And it's also responsible in stopping objects in motion or slowing them down. We experience friction in everyday, even simple activities. Like rubbing your palms together. The force you exerted produces heat due to friction. Child playing a ball on the grass. The ball moving on the grass will eventually stop because of friction, allowing the child to extend his playtime so he can kick and run after the ball. Walking. We are able to walk because friction acts between the soles of our shoes and the floor. Car on the road. This automobile moves because of friction between its tires and roads. Kinds of friction. Static friction, sliding friction, and a rolling friction. Static friction. The objects remain at rest because of balance force they exert toward each other. Example, book on the shelf, ball on the ground, and a car park on the hill. Sliding friction. It is the force that opposes sliding up an object over a surface. Example, rubbing both hands together. A sled sliding across snow or ice. A child sliding down a slide. Rolling friction. It is the force between a wheel or a roller and the surface in which in contact with. Example, a man riding a bicycle. Car traveling on the road and the shopping cart. Have you ever wondered why your feet don't sleep on the ground when you walk? Because friction is an opposing force that is present between two surfaces that are sliding across each other. Friction always resists movement and slows it down. 